of course. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the technical and tactical analysis, is Stuart Robson. And the theme of the day is long range, and this ought to be exciting. It's Barcelona, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, this long-range mode certainly encourages players to shoot from distance. A goal from outside the box counts double. It should be interesting. And here's the starting 11 for Barcelona. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays with Oriol Romeo in the centre of midfield. And leading the attack today is Robert Lewandowski. Going well. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. Eduardo Camavinga starts alongside Federico Valverde in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Vinicius Junior. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. This could be troublesome. Oh, but cutting it out in the nick of time. De Jong. Lewandowski. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, just look at this again. He moves the ball quickly, he gets beyond his marker, and he keeps his composure. It's an excellent finish. Rodrigo. Well, a stylish moment. And then there to tidy up. De Jong. De Jong. Takes it! Had to hit them, not quite accurate enough though. What a bad pass it was. Bellingham. And now Rodrigo. And he read it well defensively. did well to win the ball back a meaty but fair challenge and it will be a throw in and looking towards the back post well it wasn't the easiest header to control but still he'll be a bit disappointed Camavinga Barca regaining possession and it could be Lewandowski and it's in a goal for Barcelona they are the team in charge well they made this look so easy didn't they but as you can see the defending is really poor where were they Deserves credit for winning the ball back. And Real's creative tendencies coming to the fore. Oh, to trim back the lead. And there it is. Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. Well, that's a clinical finish. He just put his head down and smashed it past the keeper. There was no stopping that, was there? So back underway. Intriguing contest this given the 2 1 scoreline. Pedri. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and throw out the opposition. Lewandowski. Now with De Jong. Just the challenge that was required.
Frankie de Jong. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle. And the referee has got to book him, I think. Oriol Romeu. Teammates available. No fine reading of the situation. Failure to keep the ball by Barca. Carvajal. And Bellingham. Well, moving the ball impressively here. And reacting almost instinctively. Great defending. Nice weight on the pass. Well, there it is, real resilience for you, having been two goals down. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, it has taken a Herculean effort for them to get back to level pegging under these trying circumstances. And space to cross it. Nicely timed tackle. Rodrigo. Pedri. Lewandowski. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. That's not a bad ball. Well, what a piece of skill this is. It had everything. Agility, technique and power. It's a great goal. Really good build-up, but no end product. Oriol Romeu. Lewandowski now. Could be a chance to break here. A real opening now. Is high level goalkeeping. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. That's goalkeeping of the highest quality, I would say. And that's very confident goalkeeping in not easy circumstances. And you saw the situation developing. Well, getting close to half-time and Barcelona with the advantage. Stuart, what have you made of the performance? Well, what a first half we had here. Great attack in play, poor defending and some really good goals. If they can just tighten up at the back, they should win this comfortably. Now, who can he play it to? To Stegen, it's an unbelievable save! And fired over by Kroos. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Given away by Barcelona. Really inventive stuff from Real here. Takes aim. Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. Still not clear. Can they keep it out? Course. And Bellingham. They could level it. And the upshot of that is offside. Well, he needed to look elsewhere because the flag was always going to go up. And he read it well. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. That is that for the first half here. De Jong. Levant.
So back in business, the ball moving again, and Real with a bit of work ahead of them. And he's broken free. Oh, just look at that. I don't mind saying that is out of this world. Spectacular. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? Gabby. And a decent delivery. Well, thumped clear. Well timed tackle. Very quick thinking there. And Barcelona showing good width here. Lewandowski. And quick thinking defensively. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Well, an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. And it's a quality pass. With both time and space. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really inviting ball played into the box, begging players to attack it. And in the 1v1, Lewandowski makes no mistake. He never really looked like missing, did he? What a goal that is. Good tackle, take it away. Lewandowski. Oh, could be. Oh, a challenge that simply had to be won. And what a magical save it was. And there's the delivery. Oh, it's off target. They were watching him like a hawk. Rodrigo. And Real couldn't hang on to the ball. Pedri, Gabi, out of play then, Barcelona throw coming up, chance to play it in, and defensive play to be applauded, well the counter chance looks very real, oh he's through here, Snuffing out the danger, but a corner coming up. Cross with the corner. Well, still an issue here. Gabby. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. And that is the sort of tackle he had scripted in his mind. Attacking possibilities for Real. Rafinha. Lewandowski. Romeu. And if you've already received a yellow card, you surely want to stay away from that sort of challenge. Oriol Romeu. Pedri. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Cavajal. Lewandowski. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? 
Now Lewandowski carries the ball forward, but can he produce from this position? Must be! Oh, he's found the net! And that increases the advantage to two. Just what they wanted and just what they deserve. Not a scoreline we see all that often by three. Bad challenge, and now it's up to the referee in terms of what to do next. Well, a good tackle. Well, they've given him too much space. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Intercepted effortlessly. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? There. And Barcelona finding space on the flank. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Just couldn't get it through. Tony Kors. On the injury let's go down to our reporter Jeff Shreed well there's some real concern looks from the bench I have to tell you because he's landed right on top of his elbow and that's causing him some serious oh, pain Jeff, at the sorry moment. to have to cut you off but this is a chance here it's gone in and well he might celebrate on the back of that well here's the goal again and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is and Dembele's finish gives the keeper no chance he hits it with such venom Have got the stop in? Well, unfortunately, not very convincing at all with that effort. Well, he made a mess of that. Just didn't make a good connection, did he? Oriol Romeo. Perfect challenge. Modric. Is it going to be Jose though? And saved by the keeper. Textbook closing down. And now they're on the attack. Rafinha. Barcelona a little wasteful in possession. Has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw in. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. Five minutes left. De Jong given away by Barcelona. They need to get tighter here. 
Well, it came to nothing in the end. Roselu. Well, no danger now. They're really pressing their opponents. And the referee has given the advantage to Barca. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, they saw red earlier, and now they're seeing yellow, Stuart. Well, it's no good keep fouling. They have to show more discipline here. They've completely lost their composure. De Jong. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Could be a chance to break here. And he's broken free. Well, mopping up defensively. Oh, this is looking promising. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely... Well, this wonderful city offers the visitors so much, including football. Barcelona, of course. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we're absolutely in long-range mode here. It's Barcelona, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, this long-range mode certainly encourages players to shoot from distance. A goal from outside the... Oh, what an opportunity! Untidy in possession from Barcelona. Can he put it away? My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Corner kick delivery from Tony Kroos. Oh, super header, but the goalkeeper was up to the task. Well, not away properly. Save, but still a chance. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Really getting stuck in. Vinicius. Cross getting involved here. In it goes! An early opening statement in this match. And look at the celebrations. Well, just watch this again. Tony Cross's pass is inch perfect. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. 